Hi there, students. Cronies. Okay, cronies, or a crony, are long-term friends, people you've known for a long time. But be careful, because to me, I would only use this word with negative connotations. So, um, there was a gangster and his cronies uh, sitting in the pub. So a gangster and his henchmen and his long-term friends. I think a crony is somebody who is willing to help him in uh, illegal things or immoral things or dubious matters. Okay, this word crony comes from Greek, from ancient Greek. And this is related to the word chronos, time. Okay, so friends of a long time. But I wouldn't use this in the positive sense. If your girlfriend said to you, are you going drinking with your cronies tonight? Clearly, between the lines I hear, she doesn't like these people I go drinking with. They're not really her friends. She doesn't really trust them. Um, and she probably doesn't like me going out with them. Okay? So, notice this word cronies has a negative sense to it. Um, I would recommend not trying to use it in a positive sense. So, the president and his cronies are stealing money from the state left, right and centre. Well, left, right and centre. Well, it depends which way you're looking. Okay, cronies. This is a criticism. These are friends that uh, will do the same as him and agree with him because... They come from the same place. They have the same trajectory. Um, a bouncer and his cronies were standing outside the discotheque. So if there was any trouble, they could resolve it in a minute. Um, I had a verbal fight with this guy and he came back... 10 minutes later with six of his cronies and tried to beat me up. Okay, so cronies, long-term friends, but you're criticizing, you're saying you don't like them. They're willing to do as he says. They're never going to find him at fault. The country is run by a dictator and his cronies. So, they're probably all generals, okay? The dictator and his cronies. This word cronies is criticising them, saying, I don't trust them, I don't like them, I don't think they're honest. And so, cronies, henchmen, fr dishonest friends, but long-term friends. So, your next question is formality. This is informal English. You can only use this in a conversation in the pub or in maybe, well, semi-informal circumstances. But I wouldn't use it in semi-formal or formal. I think if I was writing something formal, I might use the word henchman, associates, um, associates in crime, um, his friends, something like that, okay? Um, so, don't use it formally. So, let's go through this again. Crony, a long-term friend, a long-standing friend, but by saying somebody and their cronies, you are criticising. You're saying, no, this person isn't right. So, I think you could say Mr. Trump and his cronies. The people who agree with him and will do his bidding. Okay? Remember, informal. So enough. 
If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. Cronies. Cronies.